A couple of weeks ago, I made this brass alloy by mixing some copper metal with zinc in it. But as you can see, the shape of it is bare dead still. So what we're going to do here is melt it down and remold it into this heart thing. So we're going to slap it into the furnace and then start heating it up and that, you know what I'm saying? Obviously, we've got to put the water pump in there, keep the machine cool and that. And now we're going to increase the temperature. All right, cool. So you see brass here, it's much stronger than pure copper alone, isn't it? And that's because in pure copper, all of the atoms are the same size and that. So they can easily slide over each other. So that's why it's soft and that, isn't it? But in brass, the copper and the zinc atoms are different sizes, isn't it? So obviously they can't slide over each other as easily and that. So that's why it's stronger. You know what I'm saying? Right, so we've melted down the brass and that. So we're going to remove it from the furnace and then pour it up. You know what I'm saying? Look at that, man. That looks bare nice, bruv. Little love heart thing and that, you get me? And obviously we've got this other shape as well. I don't even know what it is still. It's a nice shape though, but we're going to cool it down in some water, yeah? And obviously we've got the things there, you know what I'm saying? Proper shapes in that, yeah? Brass things, you know what time it is. 